All right, folks. So after game one, we're sitting at master 24,975, which is over 1,000th place on the world leaderboard 2289 and 2293 and 765 record with 54 days, six hours and 26 minutes until the end of season 15. What is up? Risk takers! Welcome to the Kill Pete strategy. I am Pete. I'm a top player in Risk Global Domination. I have a daily release on YouTube, doing weekday streams on Twitch, and if you are interested in getting better at the game of Risk, I invite you to subscribe to my channels and come along the ride with me. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another round of Europe Advanced Progressive Capitals! <laughs> Uh, coming off of the first game, which was a loss, we're in the first seat. We could have the pseudo Gascony Blizzard to guard the north of Spain. Do I like that? Do I want something in the middle? I don't think I want Noob Corner. I don't think I want that in Russia. My choices are either, I think, between here or here. We don't hate this. Actually, don't hate this at all. This is where I want to be. I'm pretty sure. Work on Denar Calps in the beginning of the game. All right. Uh, settings. We're playing Europe Advanced Progressive Capitals. Uh, Auto sixty expert neutral bot with true random dice. Progressive cards, alliances, and blizzards are on. Fog and portals are off. I'm in the first seat playing as Magenta. In the second seat, the green player is Apostle from Mongolia, who Captain Dinaridis, the purple player in the third seat, is Vera Sisko from Germany, who Captain Finland. The red player is June Noble 12 from the United Kingdom. In the fifth seat, the blue player is General the Great. How great is he? Let's find out. 20090 from Saudi Arabia. And finally, Iroch Kumata from Portugal playing as yellow. The Scotland cap, we have the Spain cap. Okay, and yellow takes Istanbul. Yeah, <laughs> how did I call that? That's a terrible cap for yellow. And it doesn't help them hold the split. Um, doesn't help them hold the split. Orient, okay. We take Dark Alps turn one. Let's see if green breaks. Green offers the alliance. Uh, I offer green the alliance. They accept. Green takes their bonus. Maybe they <laughs> snag the the yellow cap. <laughs> he's thinking about it. He's thinking about. Oh, he's manually. Oh, this man steals yellow's capital turn one. That is so spicy. That is so ridiculously spicy, except he has no troops on his capital. I'm totally going to steal them both. Oh, green, you suck. All right. And purple in Finland. Poor yellow. <laughs> yellow is actually going to start with, uh, does purple steal? Purple steals. Holy shit. Did they get perfect dice. <laughs> this is going to be a shit show, folks. Oh, no. <laughs> We've seen two cap hits already, and it's the fourth player's first turn. <laughs> Red's moving into the pocket. Ooh wee, ooh ooh wee. Okay, Red die. <laughs> Holy shit! Holy shit! And blue, blue holds their capital. Blue just takes space. Like, whoa, this game is fucked. <laughs> wow. So I said to myself, I sure am sick of using the slider. So here we go, folks. We got a true random shit fest for all of y'all to enjoy. All right. So for turn two, if I don't go bad to green, what happens? Yellow certainly going to try, right? Maybe breaks me in the process. No, Yellow's going to try to come through the bottom, which is way better for me because I'm going to get to hold my bonus.
Yep, and there go all your troops. Okay. Okay. That's cool. We can work with that. Yeah, this is well played. Thanks. <laughs> We're just going to break my bonus, but they're fucked. Yeah, breaks my bonus. Good shit. Well played, green. <laughs> oh, that is ridiculous. That is ridiculous. Purple holds two caps. Going to use those troops to take. Uh, noob corner now. Let's see if purple wants to be a homie. Yeah, they put troops in Italy. Why? What's that for? They're trying to remove red as quickly as possible. Yeah, because red's going to hate your guts. That makes sense. Two strong caps for purple. The two cap open, folks. Okay. Red doesn't even try to recover. So we're gonna lose, okay. And purple declines the alliance, right. Very interesting. Very interesting when people, it, it tells me a lot about their psychology, right? It tells me that their psychology is fundamentally unfriendly. When people def decline, right? I'll, I'll at least accept and then be friendly with you up to and including the point where it doesn't seem to make any sense for me. But declining just is so dumb because it's such a tell, right? It says, no, I choose to not be friends with you. Like, why would you say that? It's better to lie in that case. Okay. So we do see a stack and sue, hopefully. Help me take the third green capital. Doesn't have it yet. Ooh, he's trying to take a bono. All right, green's gonna keep fucking with you, so you so you don't have that. Right, right. Yellow's in huge trouble. With nine troops, I think we just want to remove green from this section. Oh. And this is why, folks. This is why the TR. This is why the TR will get ya. <laughs> the TR will get you every time. I just lost a eight v one. Let's see. I lost a seven v two. Oh, I lost a seven v three. Okay, I lost a seven v three. But then he lost as well. He lost on the break. Good. So the luck goes back. I figure I can play TR. Um, and the way the cap rolls are so terrible in, in balance blitz, um, not having to slider, I think is going to be fun for me. It's going to be a relief. I don't think yellow breaks my bonus. I think green failed. So now we're actually in a really good spot. Okay. I'm probably going to take some material. We're playing very cautious, but they're not going to break me. I don't think. I don't think they're an enemy. I think that was, I think the, the decline was just, I'm not favorable, but I'm not unfavorable. That's how I usually take it. Unless the decline is, is saying I'm your enemy and then, well. And it's kill or be killed, I suppose. Okay, red's taking Russia here. What's the hurry? Lol. Okay, and blue gets 10. Blue's nice and packed down in their hole so far. Let's see if blue wants to be a homie. So Dinoridis is a great cap with the Romania Blizzard, and this cap Blizzard configuration is super, super strong. I can already tell this is going to be an interesting game. Oh, Blue gonna break me. Blue, you fucking suck. All right.
I guess Blue doesn't want to get me, me getting too strong. <laughs> we lose a 6v1. <laughs> wow, these are some shit dice, folks. <laughs> these are some real shitty dice. Oh, man. Maybe this guy comes with his cap back now. Oh, he sets. He's coming in. He's coming in, folks. I don't have a follow-up trade on for. He's coming in. Oh, wow. This goes real bad. Now, lose all your troops, please. Lose all your... Get bad dice, sir. Please. Manually doesn't matter. Slattering doesn't matter. It's true random. Just lose all your dice. Goodbye. And the, the odds are still okay. Yeah, now they're getting worse. Now they're getting worse. Chugga, 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 chugga. Now they're getting worse. Chugga, 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 chugga. Defend. Defense. 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 You laugh at me. You lose all your rolls. You lose all of your rolls. You lose all of your troops. And that's a GG for green. Now, who gets that capital? Yellow gets their cap back. I'm actually going to be cool with... Oh, and he quits the game! <laughs> we had our first surrender. Green gets shit dice and quits the game. Watch fucking blue tag on this, though. Blue tags on this and actually steals that cap, which is good for... Which is really good for purple. If you're blue, I'm sure you can't super antagonize me because you also have to worry about purple. Me not having a set here sucks. Whatever. If we end up at our own capital, we end up at our own cap. Reds and Travis. Also, notably, uh, Green, who stole Yellow's cap turn one, got lowest, right? This is why we use neutral bot. Yellow and Red have both outlived Green. Both of those players actually lost their cap turn one. I guess Green lost their cap turn two. Okay. Blue player. Does Blue opportunistically try and roll my six? Hope he gets bad dice as well. Yeah, the volatility in, uh, in true random is something else, folks. The dice giveth and the dice taketh away. Yeah, Blue's thinking, oh, Blue's taking North Africa. Cool, 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 cool. So I'm just going to try and establish, and I'm going to hope that purple and blue hit each other. Purple's in a really strong position. Blue's in a really strong position. I'm weak, comparatively. If yellow doesn't take that third cap, I do. Yeah, blue gets good roll. Oh no, blue takes that third cap. Thinks about it. Thinks about it, doesn't. Okay. Leaves a stack. What does yellow do? Yellow takes the cap with a set. Don't take mine. Take the blue. Take the green one. I'm going to let you fucking hold that shit, too. <laughs> we lose a three on one. <laughs> we lose three on a one. <laughs> now yellow and I are cool, and we can go different directions. We cool? You happy? Yes? I hope you're happy. I hope you're happy. Yeah, and purple just spiraling. Okay, so blue will probably need to address purple. I mean, breaking me, sure. Good good job, but also... Yellow's back in this game now. Good for yellow. I'm, I hope I hope we're... Fuck, man, my caps are still so fucking weak. It's the trade. Trade is 10. Red's not, though. Red dies. Red keeps chipping at yellow. Yep. Maybe I don't get to hold that plus four. All right, if you're blue, you at some point start thinking about hitting purple. Unless they have a very, very solid alliance. Right, a 20 stack here goes up. Maybe steals the five cap. Fortify the seven there. Yellow can't deal with you. 
Blue thinks the other way. Blue thinks to take Africa and give Yellow nothing. He's more worried about the retaliation from Purple. I think we've seen most of my bad luck so far. Hopefully we get more average luck for the rest of the game. As the numbers get larger, your luck tends to average out. He guards his capital strong. All right. Does Yellow break? It's my two. Well played, Yellow. All right, we take the 10 here. And take a second plus four. All we need to do. Guarding with threes. Because it's true random. At some point, the red kill is going to be viable. Yes, he goes bad to blue. Yes, we were waiting for that. Good, 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 good. Nobody has patience <laughs> in these Alliance metagames. Also, lots of players still alive. I think red sets last. Does red try and steal one of my caps with it? Probably not. Just not going to be enough troops. Takes Russia here. Oh no, he fucks with, with yellow. Ah, that sucks. Why wouldn't you take a bonus? Just trying to generate from territory. Why would blue add there? What? Oh, okay. Just guarding his three fronts. Pops the eight. Thinks about popping the eight. He tries to offer the alliance here. That's what I bet he's doing. Yeah, and the alliance was accepted, right? That's what I would do if I was blue. I think blue's good. Yep. Yellow breaks. All right, I don't retake. Um, you want to car block yourself off your cap? That's fine by me. I take no bonus, but I clean out a lot of board. Purple breaks again? Yeah! That's what I wanted to see! Purple's an asshole! All right. Purple's an asshole. Fuck yeah. Now, if, if blue has a set... Oh, this is fantastic. This is fantastic right now. Blue has a set. It goes right up purple's ass. Yellow choosing to um, break my bonus there was probably unwise. He should have tried for a card against red. Blue sets gets the 20, and that goes up purple's ass, right? Right up to the Scotland cap is what I would do. And up. Yeah, and 10. Smack a Reno. It's perfect dice on a 10. That was fun. <laughs> that was fun to see. Yeah, okay. He gets perfect dice on a 10. Now purple's fucked. Purple loses all of their bonuses, and they lost a capital. But they have cards, so they can continue the war. My job here is to lay low. I can kill green for a single card. I can try and interrupt. Yes. Now where do you put your stack, though? Okay, so now... Um, 
this guy is card blocked. We take a plus eight, which is pretty scary, but I figure purple has problems with blue. Sets gets the 25, retakes his shit. Does the 30 go back to break Spain? I would love to see that. Stops there, right? Splits, some on cap, some on London. Okay. If red has cards, he's close to stealing the yellow cap. He's going to get the green kill. I'm going to run through my bonuses to do it. I think he's going to fail the green kill, actually. Okay, Red gets a single card from that, but he beats the shit out of me. <laughs> All right, so purple or uh, so yellow might be card blocked off their capital. So yellow's going to need to use a set here. Blue guarding here is super, super dumb because you're not really offering anything to yellow. I've tried to play nice with them. Don't get to hold my bonuses, which sucks. All right, the war between purple and blue has finally stopped. Where am I in troops? I'm middle of the pack in terms of troops. All right. Can I kill yellow and set? That actually might be the line if he sits on five cards. Yeah, that is the line. If he sits on five cards, I kill yellow. Great. No slidering feels so good. Now we now we fucking have a great board position. Blue didn't accept. Trying to offer the alliance to purple again. We're sitting on five cards. We can punch back. Doesn't break me, right? I wouldn't break me if I were you. Unwise. All right, so red's next, right? Red's the fish. Red's going to have four cards, and their kill is going to be... Mm-hmm. You feel that? Yes. 
Okay, the set is 45. I don't go super negative killing red. I just have to not miss. How do you reliably kill a two though in, in TR? You need like 10 troops. I might miss this red kill. I'm going to go for it. Does blue help me at all? Maybe it's not the move. I'll play it safer than that. Okay. Fred goes to five, I kill him for sure. Purple sets. I keep this cap intentionally low because it sucks. This cap is garbage. I want a really big cap though. Purple is guarding, I think. How are we doing for cards? No set. I mean, I'm okay lined up to kill red now. He doesn't trade, and if he does, we'll see what he hits. If he does, he might want to hit a cap off a of purple. I mean, if I was red, I'd really start thinking about taking a capital. Let's see what he does. Let's see if he just takes a set and pumps it all up my ass. Maybe he takes the stun bull cap and gets punished on the dice. Okay, he does set. Where does that go? Istanbul? Does it go into blue? I think it takes Istanbul. Loses six on a six is fine. Lose big on the 10? Lose big on the 10. Okay, loses 17 on a 10. We like that. We like that a lot. And now this guy is back behind me in the same way that yellow was, and I'm going to lock him on that fucking shitty Istanbul cap. Blue doesn't get involved. You will die the same way yellow died. You saw how I killed yellow. I'm going to kill you the exact same way. I'm going to kill you the same way. Good game, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, no set on four is bad. Oh man, purple's such a dick. <laughs> Breaking me is okay. Well, let me have anything, though. Maybe I prioritize hitting purple because he's really dumb and he's leaving his fucking cap cap very open, right? So on a set, I take Scotland, but I don't give it back to him like Blue did. I just take Scotland. Not having a set here fucking sucks.
maybe we pull a cap switch. We go to a single capital and take cards. Let the game stalemate. Fuck you, you fucking loser. <laughs> you don't get to break my shit and then accept my alliance. Fuck you. Fuck you. You know what that says? That actually says fuck you. That says fuck you. You're a fucking loser. <laughs> fuck that guy. What an asshole. Blue skips. Doesn't take a card. Okay, I, I single cap because I don't want a double tap, right? I don't want two guys hitting weaker caps. I have a 100 cap that is um, fucking... Yes, purple takes this to block red. Right. No, we'll go into the three player. We'll go into the three player at, at a bit of a deficit here. Yeah. <sighs> Maybe red hits that because depending on how many troops purple moves to it, I think having this cap, red saw how I killed yellow, so they don't close that cap line. He just takes it. He doesn't even hold it. You're such an asshole. Well, if nobody takes it, I can put a set on it. Maybe blue takes it. Blue takes it, right? Blue takes it. Why wouldn't blue take it? Blue doesn't take it. Okay. Is it worth to kill red? 65? Yeah, I think it is worth to kill red. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Ladies, gentlemen. I don't actually want Istanbul at all. I want Dinaridis. Neither of these guys ally me. Now we can ally. Now we can fucking ally because I have shit. Now we can ally. Do you do it? I will work with you now. Okay. You can hit me. Oh no, he just, he just, he's just like, no, fuck you. That was a, that was an, I'm going to hit you. <laughs> all right, cool. See, now I was down to hit, now I was down to kill blue with you, right? Because blue's bigger than both of us. That was the most, you have to have something in it for me. Otherwise, why would I work with you? I don't mind him hitting me a little bit, right? You just can't break every fucking bonus I have and let blue spiral. That's fine. That is totally fine. You can break a fucking bonus. That is totally fine. I don't care, man. You think I give a shit about a plus four? I do I've killed two players. <laughs> I've killed two fucking players with their cards. Oh my God. Ah, some people, I tell you. <laughs> Blue says good with me. Blue card skipping too. It's really fucking dumb.
Yeah, we depressurize off blue. He can break me if he wants. I'm he's letting me hold split orient, so split orient is fucking great. Now purple's fucked, I think. At the 75 trade. Okay, purple takes it. Shores up his capitals. Bo both of his caps are locked and his primary guard stack is locked. Only the 46 is open. So where does that go? Cool. Does blue lose patience and break me, or does blue is blue on the team? Let's kill this guy. Let's just fucking kill this guy and go into an honest 1v1. What do you say? Cool. All right, now the purple cab is open. Let's see if they decide to use it. It's good. Everyone's thinking now. This is less dynamic, but more strategic. Purple just gets a card and passes. Does he threaten blue? Yeah. Get a card and pass. Okay. I mean, I like my board position a lot. We're in a leading board position now. Blue has a good one too, though. Blue and I are, are stronger than purple, I think, but not by much. Okay. Blue guards his capital. Don't blame that. That's a big capital. All right, stick it up fucking purple's ass. There's no reason for this guard stack to not be here. We can just choke out purple, card block him or something. I was going to do that. I shouldn't have opened the 70 cap, though. I'm still waiting for a purple to run around me and into blue. Uh, sure. If blue opens my cap to the action, that would actually be good. We almost have a card block on. I could put a ton of troops here too. Force them to smack it to get a card. You, you hit me, dude. That's totally fine.
those purple set. Great fucking game. I love this game. Not strong enough to take the lead and just kill one of these guys because I'll lose in the 1v1. But this status quo is good. Yeah, close off your cap line. Close off your cap line, purple. Okay, blue takes the 90 trade. Blue's not willing to commit anything to the war. Well, frankly, I don't blame him. Ooh, steps up. I like that. 136, step up. Yeah, I like that a lot. Good, good shit. Let's card block this guy. Yeah. Fucking card block this guy. Oops. <laughs> see what he does with his set. I th I see a run coming now. I want purple to exhaust his troops. Before we try and set up a block. He doesn't even realize it is set yet. Now he does. Ah, puts it up my ass. Well played. Yeah, at least he hits a little of blue. Ooh, blue lost a lot more troops than I did there. Run up off the 133. Don't put anything there. That's stupid. Take the Scotland cap. Run up off the 133 and take the Scotland cap. Oh, blue tolerates that. Or... Me and blue are good. I think purple's the one who's going to get teamed on now. Okay, we have a set. Okay, we're allies. He's going to hit me again. He's going to break. He's going to hit me and break. <laughs> I like how you use alliances, purple. Is this guy German? Yeah. The decline, the initial decline, and then the only accepting after he fucked me right in the ass is really telling. Does that go down into blue? I hope it does. Okay, that's good. That's good. Because he's pissing off... This guy has zero diplomatic ability, right? He's pissing off both of his opponents at the same time, which I love. Which I do love. And he misses his fortify. Okay, does blue take the chance to steal his capital? Yes, he does. That goes up and takes Scotland. Yeah. No, it cleans the pocket. All right, now, no, okay, okay, good. It takes Scotland. Perfect. Now, we don't fuck with this at all. We actually shore up Istanbul.
Yeah. Purple, Purple gives themselves third from this. Pretty sure. Yeah, what did you think was going to happen, you dumbass? What in the fuck did you think was going to happen? Yeah, but Blue gives it back. Ah, oh, Blue giving it back fucking sucks. And my caps are now locked. there. There's no way for Purple to get it without obliterating all his troops. Yeah. He just hits blue here. No, it goes around the bottom. He takes a stun bull. Yeah. No, he hits blue. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Hit blue. Sue into blue. I love that. Even better. whoop -a! Your only cap now is Finland, sir. Oh, he's going to stack on blue. Oh, wow. Purple feeds me the win. <laughs> I love that. That's great. Poor blue. What do you do if you're blue here? I also don't know why blue pissed off fucking purple so much. Probably kill purple and take second if you're blue. He doesn't. Purple doesn't know what to do. Realizes he fucked up and fed me the win. Oopsie doopsie. Does he bought from this? Does he bought from this? Yep, yeah, looks like he's quitting. Quitting time. Do the capital. Sue the capital. Fortify back to cap? What do you do? Prepare B. No, he goes. <laughs> All right, now blue should just kill him and take second. I'll give it to blue. He does. He's going to get the kill. Smellulator purple. Zero diplomatic skill. Can I kill this man with 51 troops? He probably doesn't have a set on three. Let's say so let's try, but we literally have zero caps open to this line. Let's try it. Let's go for the kill. We feed it to blue. We feed it to blue. Eight for four on that line, and we run out of steam. Let off some steam. Okay, 
And if purple adds a set, he sets, he doesn't, he sues the capital, doesn't get another card. Yeah, smell you later, purple. And blue, ah, and he quits. All right, he locks in his third placement. Good game, guys. All right, that one went very well. Maybe we stick with TR. A lot of volatility in the early game when your troop counts are lower. So you do have to account for that. But as soon as, interestingly enough, right, as soon as the numbers get large enough, um, the volatility fades away and you end up with a more regular representative probabilistic game in terms of roles, which I like. So we're going to think about that during this grind. You give Blue a good game now. There's no way he can get me. He only has a single capital. He can hit me as hard as he'd like, but... He's going to sue right into, right into the 322? Or is he going to try and play to win? I don't think you can play to win, right? I have triple your troops and a set in the kitty. Maybe he wants the 33 cap? I see what he's doing, not opening my capitals. That's smart. No shit, no set. Big fortify there. No set here sucks. Okay, so I'll let him I'll let him attack me on the bottom line. If he happens to have a trade. Or in the middle line if he happens to have a trade. And I'll give him a good game. You should be happy with second. Well played good game, man. General the Great was indeed great. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you all enjoyed this video. Hope you found some of this fun and entertaining, maybe even a little bit educational and informative. And that's one in one. If you are interested in getting better at the game of risk, I invite you to subscribe to my channels. Come along the ride with me. I'm liking the settings for their diplomatic skill in addition to strategies and tactics. Blue was a novice, if you can believe it. Yellow and purple were beginners. Okay. Red was a master. Kind of surprised. Green was an expert with that turn one cap hit, folks. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And until next time, for all of you on the path to world domination, good games and good luck.